there's nothing more that I hate than being on the bench. I'd rather be on the field doing something, whether it's the outfield, first base, pitching, whatever it is. It's just more fun to be on the field than off the field. You know, last freshman year, he just swung the bat. We didn't pitch him much just to let him, you know, being a freshman is tough to do both. Lo and behold, he's become a Friday night starter last year. And rolling into this season, he'll be the ace of our staff again. Houston was always close to home, and Houston has always been really good growing up. There's definitely something special about being 30 minutes close to home. Parents would come to every game. It's not a huge inconvenience. It's just awesome. Most impactful people in my life are definitely my parents. My dad started a business from the ground up. My mother's been a huge role model for me. She went through breast cancer last year. That was definitely a hard time with us. But I mean, she fought through it, survivor. She's an absolute animal back there. And kind of have some a situation like that come up, it really humbles you to a really deep level. Love to have them both in my corner, that's for sure. Hitting from both sides of the plate and being a switch hitter, it wasn't really an option that I had. My dad forced it upon me on day one, and it's just kind of I stuck with. From first at bat, a t-ball was right-handed, second at bat was left-handed, and it was like that way until I was about 12 year old when you uh, start playing kid pitch, and you just go off the pitcher, whether he's left or right-handed. Speak softly, but carry a big stick is something that we've always kind of preached here. And if you do your work, guys will tend to notice and follow your footsteps in that way. Well, that was awesome. Uh, he's uh, pretty quiet. He's kind of like a volcano, you know, with, with grass and flowers all over. Does like to yell a little bit though. When when everybody else is yelling, he can definitely tell he's yelling. Uh, he looks calm on the outside, but on the inside, he's a really, really competitive kid. Probably as competitive kid as I've ever had in this program. Really fun to be around. I uh, always got jokes and stuff. So. He's a good dude, he's awesome. He's also my roommate. <laughs> Pizza box is on the counter all the time. I would definitely describe my uh, game style as taking a lot of pride in coming off the field dirty rather than having a clean uniform, just busting it down the line, stretching a single into a double, just the hustle plays. He's an unbelievable competitor. He's a bulldog on the mound. He will come right at you. He literally has no fear, and that's what you want from that Friday night guy and somebody that's going to hit probably in the middle of our order this year. Um, you want that fiery competitor, you know, the leader type guy of your program that brings some enthusiasm and brings energy to what you're doing into your dugout. To lead by example, do everything the way you would want it to be done treat the guys how you want to be treated. It's not a bad day when you're on the baseball field. It's always a great day to be out here. 